Hey, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth, this is EJ Joyful Plans. And today we're talking, well, we're drinking, we're drinking coffee and we are talking about the spring 2021 Happy Planner release and all of the items I picked up. This is going to be a haul, it's a haul video. So I am going to do more detailed flip throughs in separate videos, so stay tuned for that. Let's get to it, let's see what I picked up and let's start with planners. Planner number one that I picked up. This is the monthly layout. It's the doodles. And I'll open it. I'll give you guys a little sneaky peeky. Um, but this is the monthly layout. Very neutral. It's why I picked it up. So if you want to see a flip through of this and my impressions and thoughts, then stay tuned for a future video. But this is planner number one, 18 months, the monthly layout. There were two monthly layout options that I could see, both of them exclusive to Michael's. There was this Doodles one, and then there was one that was like a Celestial monthly. And while that one was more neutral in tones, there are a few reasons why I picked this one instead. So watch that flip through video to hear more about why I picked the doodles one, even though I like neutral planners. So planner number one is the doodles. Planner number two that I flipped out over is this bad boy or beautiful girl. I don't know. This is the color block layout. It's got a beautiful pewtery, gunmetal y tone, metallic tone to it. These discs, I was not expecting to be in like silver or gunmetal or pewter. I need to figure out the difference between the two. Um, but the disc color here is like really interesting and unexpected. This is what I'm going to be using for work. I do a full flip through of this one coming up. So check out the videos or my videos, turn on the notifications to see my flip through of this. This is gorgeous. Yes, it's a color block, but it's gorgeous. And it is perfect for those of you who like me work a Monday through Friday job. So if you want to see a full th th flip through and how I'm going to be using this for work, then uh, hit that notification bell. So these are the, the two planners I picked up. Let's transition over to miscellaneous stickums, stickies, and accessories. I picked up the vinyl stickers, color block vinyl stickers. I will again pull these out and do a full uh, show of these guys in another video. I picked up these spring garden stickers. There's five sheets in here. Um, both of these I believe were exclusive to Joann's and they had a sale and I just, I had to. So I will do another video flipping through these guys and Two more items in the non-sticker book related category would be these Mambi sticks, these Disney Mambi sticks. Again, I will do a full flip through of these sheets in another video. I just think they are gorgeous. Here, we'll layer them this way. And the last, well, I'll throw this in here. This I picked up. This was also a Joann's online order. This was not part of the spring 2021 release. It's been out for a while, but I have nothing in the skinny mini size. And so I wanted to get a cover for the skinny mini size. And when I saw that this was, look how neutral this is. Actually, we'll cut this off. Um, this super neutral dot grid paper with this really beautiful beige toned spine, striped spine. I just thought the paper was cute. It's super small, would fit into my purse. And I just thought for a notebook, this is like just, it's adorable. <laughs> it's adorable and I had been eyeing it and I had a coupon and it was on sale. So I picked that up. And then the last non-sticker book related item I picked up were these snap-in sticker sheet protectors. And again, I will do a full kind of tutorial of how these work in a future video. So these are the non-sticker book related items that I picked up from the release. And now let's look at the sticker books. You guys, I picked up seven, seven sticker books. You heard me right, seven sticker books. Um, these, Gosh, let me show you. So of course I had to have the Indigo. I've been on a Navy kick for a while. And honestly, I have flipped through this. I wish that there was more Navy and I wish it hadn't been called Indigo. Maybe it should have been called tie-dye uh, because this is a tie-dye book. This is a blue tie-dye book 
with all different shades of blue. Um, so I, I like this book. I'll use this book. I have already used this book, but um, I want more navy still. So it scratches the itch, but I could use more of this, this navy tone. The next book I picked up is Girl with Goals. I would say this is probably one of my favorite books from this release. Just the beautiful plums, the grays, uh, the gold, the art deco design. Uh, this is going to go beautifully with the planner that I picked out. It indeed is actually for it. Um, but even if you didn't get the Girl with Goals planner, this book, you guys, this is a standout. They have not done, the Happy Planner has not done some of these stickers and I was super pumped to see them. Sophisticated Florals, I had to have this book. I missed out on the Be Happy, was it a Be Happy box or was it just a box bundle? Uh, in any case, it sold out within like an hour and so I didn't get it and it included the Sophisticated Florals book. So when I heard that Happy Planner was releasing this as a part of their spring release, I was so excited and I'm sure those of you who missed out on that box were super pumped for it as well. The handwritten color boxes is not part of the spring release, but this was not available at Michael's before this spring. Uh, I looked at Michael's, I, I couldn't find it anywhere. I think this was exclusive to the Happy Planner website. So when I saw that it was on the Michael's website, and again, it was on sale, I I was like, well, I need to have it. And I don't necessarily love the, the font, on these colored boxes, but I know that there are some shapes in here we haven't seen before. There are colors that we haven't seen here before. So I was like, you know, it's on sale. I love colorful boxes and I can always white out the, the handwritten part. So that's why I got that. This is obviously a standout from this collection. I wasn't buying a lot of Happy Planner when they had the, the um, I think it was an an the anniversary box. I th well, maybe I was just getting into at least social media, Happy Planner social media. And so I kind of slept on that anniversary box that had black, three black and white sticker books. And I totally regret it. So I was really glad they came out with this. I'd love if they did a black and white florals book. Oh my gosh, that would be amazing. So I definitely picked that up. I feel like a couple of these books are Elizabeth making up for lost time. <laughs> So yeah, excited for that. This was a surprise book to me. Surprise in that I love it so much. This is the Happy Plans book. All of the colors are, they're both like bright, but like pastel, very sherberty. And I really loved the, the font, the layered font here, shadowing font and the words, clear words in here. There's also a lot of these like gold dots layered on on a lot of the stickers and something about that design just was like speaking to me so I have a feeling this is going to be one of my favorite sticker books from this collection and I love big words big phrases so this this page right here is a standout to me and the last book like I said I didn't get that last happy be happy box. I can't remember if it was a Be Happy box or a bundle, but I missed out on that. So I did pick up the pressed florals. This is just a beautiful book. I love that there are a lot of colorful boxes and then big, clear quotes and words. I live for those. And I have flipped through this and the pressed floral stickers look like real flowers that are pressed. They nailed it. So these are the seven, seven sticker books that I picked up. I don't think I've purchased this many stickers in one sitting ever, but I will, in all fairness to my wallet, I bought these on sale. I am also, uh, I work in education and so I got a teacher discount. So stacks on stacks on stacks of deals. So that's what I got guys. I got the seven sticker books. I got this five sheet uh, spring garden. I got the vinyl stickers. I got the Mambi sticks, the Disney Mambi sticks the snap-in protectors, this little guy, and the, if I can grab them, the two planners. Yes, I think that's everything. There are two items, two elusive items missing from this haul that I'm still on the hunt for, and those were exclusive to Hobby Lobby. It was the Indigo accessory book and the Girl with Goals accessory book. I want both of those very badly. So as soon as Hobby Lobby gets them 
and they're on a paper crafting sale cycle, I will definitely get those two books. And then I think I have to call it from this release. I was very much intrigued by the snapping covers that were exclusive to their website. Since pretty much everything else that I wanted I could find in stores, I decided to pass on buying the snapping covers. I also have um, two snapping covers that I really like that are kind of that deluxe style from Jean's Agenda. I also have, gosh, like four deluxe hardcovers from the Happy Planner and they're my standard go-to for covers. So I feel like I'm good on the cover front. Otherwise, if I had placed an online order with the Happy Planner, I would have thrown in one of those snapping covers. But that's pretty much it, guys. What did you pick up from the Happy Planner release? Uh, do you agree with some of my picks? What did you get that I didn't, that you love and that you would recommend? And... Yeah, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Yeah, just let me know what, what was missing from this collection. I think they did a really great job. Uh, just, yeah, it blew me away. It was a huge release and I went a little ham. So that's all I have for you guys today. Stay tuned. I'm going to have more detailed flip throughs up on my channel shortly, probably over the next few days. And you'll get a really good glimpse at all this good stuff. So stick with me, hit that notification bell so that you know when I've posted a new video, make sure you're subscribed to my channel. Come hang out with me over on the gram. You guys, I am super active over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. And I just, I just love hanging out with the planner community over there. I'm very active in my stories. I try to respond really quickly to messages as well. And it's just, it's just a good time. Until next time, and until I see you guys over on Instagram, God bless you and keep you. Do something creative today. And I'll see you in my next video. Cheers.